This week on The Bloom, we're talking tomatoes. POVs, tomatoes on the vine, are our primary crop, and we have some beefsteak tomatoes as well. During the summer months, we have some uh, orange and yellow tomato on the vines. Peak season right now is, is for a greenhouse, has a lot to do with the, your light source. So this would be considered the peak time of the year because you have the most amount of daylight causing the plants to grow at their fastest pace. So between now and September is, is primarily your, your peak season. Fortunately, with the greenhouse, of course, we can grow year-round, so that means you know we've got fresh, organically-grown tomatoes in the middle of December and January when it's cold everywhere. Well, the market in general has a tendency to be a little bit soft this time of the year just because of the supply that's out there, but for us, based on what we're doing, we've got a really high-end product, and you know, quality always has a market, and that's what the backbone of our program is about. We don't run into some of those roadblocks like other people have. We've just got really, really nice tomatoes. We are harvesting in La Piedad, uh, Mechilcan, Mexico. We're in production year-round, and these are all hothouse grown, so there is no peak season. Basically, we harvest one cluster a week, and that continues. We'll uh, harvest one plant for 15 to 18 weeks, and we plant such that we're always harvesting, which gives us very consistent, steady production throughout the year. We actually start harvesting about the 15th of July, and we'll start with Roma tomatoes, fine ripe brown tomatoes, and organics of both of those as well. Marty's been tough. I mean, throughout, like I say, the winter months and coming into the spring, it's been pretty weak market price, but we're hoping that things will start to stabilize as things transition from Mexico back into the United States and California in particular, that the market will kind of correct itself and get back to normal. I think the big thing is just to think about U.S. grown field tomatoes. Kind of the peak of the season is the summer months into the fall as far as availability goes. We're excited about that and the organics program and, you know, the fact that we have domestic supplies of, of really good tomatoes. Our peak season is really later on in the fall. Right now we're uh, kind of at the steady eddy type of time frame, but uh, in the fall is when we really peak in production. Started down the desert in mid-May and uh, finished up the desert deal already, and now we're here in the San Joaquin Valley. So, uh, yeah, we started up here just recently, but we've been going since mid-May. The heat we had here over the weekend uh, took its toll. It got a little bit more... Uh, sunburn but uh, other than that it's been pretty good we've got uh, great tomatoes coming out of california and everybody's just kind of getting going in their production for the summertime and we look forward to having a great crop of uh, good tasting flavorful tomatoes for them i'm sarah hoxie thank you for watching the bloom